we're very happy to announce a brand new package of pre-designed dashboard components that can be utilized within Finstack. Our team has put together a variety of easy to use charts and gauge components that each feature their own configuration wizards that allow users to create fully customizable dashboards quicker and easier than ever before. Starting with the charts, let's go over a few feature highlights on what these new dashboard component models can offer. One of the first highlights here is the availability and variety of the provided components. Once you've added the Fin AM Chart component pod to your Finstack server, your Graphics Builder component library will be automatically updated with a special variety of selected charts that can be accessed and used at any time on any graphic. All you need to do to begin using a chart component is drag and drop it onto your workspace. The second major highlight is how easily customizable and configurable each individual chart component can be. We've designed and added configuration wizards that are unique to each individual chart component and can be accessed through a simple right click of the mouse. As I stated before, each wizard will have unique properties based on the chart that you're configuring, but there are also common configurations that can be found on most, if not all, available charts. One of those common configurations is the theme. Each component can be set to a certain theme based on what's available inside of the Finstack project. Here's an example of what our default light and dark themes would look like on the same chart. Another configuration that is common to all charts is the ability to select a chart type. Some charts will have various options to choose from. Here's a visual example of what the difference is between a Curval chart type and a history chart type. The most common chart type from our experience would be the history chart type. And if you choose history as the charts type, our wizard will automatically provide you with a handful of easily selectable date range options to determine which time frame the chart will display histories for. One of the best features of the configuration wizard for charts is the ability to predetermine how many points will be displayed on the chart. And the best part about that is as you go through the configuration wizard, it will automatically provide you with an individual point selector dropdown and color selector text field for each point that will be displayed on the chart. The point selector dropdowns make it exceptionally easier to select your data from an automatically populated list of virtual points. And then the color selector gives you an unlimited range of colors to choose from. The color selection offers four different methods of input. One option is to leave it blank, which will use a certain set of default colors. Another option is to simply type in a color name such as red, purple, yellow, or orange. Users can also put in a RGB or hex color code to get a more specific color result if needed. Here is an example of what that looks like. Okay, so now let's move on and take a look at the gauges. The gauges offer a much larger variety of components. The available components are a mix of bar gauges, half circle and full circle gauges, and some very simple yet aesthetically pleasing icon style gauges. The true beauty of the gauge components provided lies in how simple they are to use. Users can simply drag out any gauge they'd like to use and then drag and drop their virtual point onto the component to create an instant binding. However, if a user does want to customize or configure his gauge even further, they can totally do so. Each gauge features its own personalized configuration wizard that contains unique properties to the gauge being configured. Most gauges have simple properties allowing the user to change its default display name to a custom name and the ability to select the colors for nearly every individual portion of the component. Certain gauge types will feature their own unique properties. For example, the half circle and full circle gauges typically have a lot of color options to choose from and they usually also offer a min and max value that can be determined by the user. Most icon gauges feature the ability to hide and show their labels and background to help create a regular icon or a tiled icon look. And lastly, most bar gauges feature the unique ability to be tilted horizontally or vertically. 
Ultimately, these components are all made with the intent of simplifying and improving how quickly and easily dashboards are made in Finstack while still retaining the ability to customize and tweak the components any which way to fit the end user's needs. To further promote having a cosmetic consistency and overall symmetrical format in the dashboards, we've included the ability to add a themed background to each and every dashboard component, which can be found and enabled in the configuration wizard. If you look in the components section, you will also find a miscellaneous category, which has a pre-themed title label, which that features its own configuration wizard and can be used in your dashboards for even more visual consistency. All right, so that includes our quick look at the newest dashboard components and how easy it is to utilize them and create stunning dashboards in just minutes. Creating dashboards in Finstack has never been easier. We hope you've enjoyed this video. If you like the content, please subscribe to our channel below. Thanks for watching.